In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for AlNO3 3 plus Li2CO3. We have aluminum nitrate and lithium carbonate. So to do this, the first thing we have to do, we have to balance the molecular equation. And this here is the molecular equation. So I can see that I have an aluminum here, but I have two here in the product. So I'm going to put a two in front of the aluminum nitrate. Balances the aluminums, but now I have three nitrate ions times two. I have six. So I'm going to have to put a six in front of the lithium carbonate. Now I have six lithium atoms. So let's put a three here. Three times two is six. Those are balanced. Three carbonate ions over here. Three carbonate ions. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now we have to balance the net ionic equation. To do that, we'll write the state for each substance first. So compounds with the nitrate ion, they're very soluble. So those are going to dissolve, dissociate into their ions. Compounds with carbonates in general are insoluble, except when we have group one elements like lithium, sodium, potassium. So lithium carbonate is soluble, but aluminum carbonate, aluminum is not in group one. So aluminum carbonate is going to be a solid. That means it's going to fall to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate. So those are the states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions, and that's going to give us the complete ionic equation. Note that we don't split solids apart when we do net ionic equations, so we'll keep the aluminum carbonate together. So when we split apart the strong electrolytes, we get this. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. So I see in the reactants here, we have six nitrate ions here and six nitrate ions here. Those are spectator ions. Six lithium ions, again, six lithium ions, spectator ions. We cross them out. In what's left, that's the net ionic equation for AlNO3 3 plus Li2CO3. I'll clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for aluminum nitrate plus lithium carbonate. Notice that charges balance 2 times 3 plus, that's 6 plus, 3 times 2 minus, 6 minus. So that adds up to 0. Over here, neutral compound, net charge of 0. Charge is conserved, and if you count the atoms up, you'll see they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.